Today, you're going to learn how to operate a teleprompter using Rundown Creator. The first thing you'll want to do is make sure that the controlling computer is powered on and logged in. Using a web browser such as Google Chrome, log in to Rundown Creator. Once logged in, load the rundown that corresponds with the show you are about to help broadcast from the top drop-down menu. Navigate to the arrow next to the show's date in the header bar and click on it. That presents you with a drop-down menu of options. Select Teleprompter. The controller features a jog shuttle wheel as well as some buttons. These buttons are mapped shortcuts. Look for the one that is labeled Make Full Screen to set the browser into full screen mode, removing any toolbars. Use the jog shuttle wheel to control the pace at which the talent reads the script. Clockwise advances the script and counterclockwise reverses it. The goal is for the talent to always be reading the line indicated by the arrow. This lets their eyes have enough content below to scan ahead so no word trips them up. The outer ring features a spring-loaded mechanism where the moment you let go as the operator, the prompter stops advancing. Unlike the outer ring, the inner wheel can be used to set a smooth, automatic pace using a hands-off approach. Both the controller and top menu additionally have buttons to make navigating through each block of the show easier by providing a quick way to advance through the content. If a typo is discovered during rehearsal, the teleprompter operator has the ability to go in and quickly make a correction. To return to the rundown, press Escape or just use the Edit button on the controller or top menu to pull up that block's show script where the text can then be corrected and updated everywhere once the change is made. If a producer or writer changes a script, there is no need to update the teleprompter. The teleprompter will automatically update, so there is no need to refresh. You can also change the display characteristics by going to the top menu. If the talent can't see the teleprompter on set, it could be because the camera's prompters are not properly powered up. And if there is a need to produce a show with a smaller staff, the talent can remotely control the teleprompter from the anchor desk out in the studio.